we're also getting some uh, latest information and we're streaming that into the studio live that some aggrieved customers of Men's Gold Ghana in Takwa and its environs whose uh, investments have been locked up in the company have hit the streets of the township, Takwa, demanding that the president, Nanado Dankwe Kufuado, and other institutions that needed to ensure that uh, their monies are retrieved for them do so. And uh, Inathalia Kwanza has been begin, br bringing to us the latest update on that. She's monitoring the situation. Uh, is going to join us uh, on, on phone. Good morning to you, Ina. Good morning, Roland. Mm -hmm. And um, th this is uh, some picketing that you just picked up, or it's something that had been arranged? Uh, this is something I just picked up from the ground. And uh, these are sorts of aggrieved customers of men's goods who are demonstrating. They are working to um, the premises of the MCE to re-echo their petition. But Roland, I have with me the national president for aggrieved customers of men's gold, Francis Owusu. So we speak to him briefly. Yes, and Francis, tell us, why are you demonstrating this morning? We are demonstrating this morning because the government has clearly showed that he doesn't care about the plight of men's gold customers. We have embarked on a series of demonstrations. We have petitioned the president, and as we speak, there's nothing concrete on the table. And people are dying day by day. My, my sister, the way this men's gold issue has affected the good people of Takwa and its environment, that of Kumasi and Accra, is something that cannot be quantified. People are losing family, uh, school, uh, broken homes, and others are dying on their sick bed. They don't have money to even to pay for the hospital bills. Meanwhile, their money are sitting with men's gold. And this man, the, the reason why we are blaming government is that government is part of the problem of, uh, of men's gold saga. And government must be part of the solution. It is as a result of the intervention of uh, sex that brought all these issues. At the point that sex realized that men's gold doesn't have lunches to operate, they should have taken measures to ensure that we receive our investment back. But they didn't do that. So we are putting everything squarely on the government that until we find a lasting solution to this problem, we are not going to rest. Yes, but you can set me up a series of demonstrations. So can you walk us through? From Tapa, we were going back to Marseille mm. to organize one, uh, five, over 500,000 demonstrations against uh, men's vote customers demonstrations in Marseille. And we go back to Accra. And that Accra one, it will be at the third office. Because we believe that this whole men's goal saga is great look and share. Since looking at the government uh, poster and how even those institutions have conducted themselves, how come an appear Minister left this country at the blind side of the security agency? How come, as we speak, we have this $1 million of men's gold money with stock box and the government is quiet over it? We are not talking about it. So we want government as a matter of agency to conduct a forensic audit committee to investigate the $51 million that is with a local boss so that the ordinary uh, Ghanaian or customers of men's gold can have some uh, relief from this uh, trauma that we are going through. Okay, thank you. So, Roland. Hello, Roland. Ina, uh, and so um, who did yes, they so intend? Yes, you had the PRO uh, explaining these issues to us. Yes. Um, uh, are, are they just protesting in, in the open or they want to perhaps do they want to present a petition to maybe any dignitary authority within the it's, area? It's a bit noisy, yes. Okay, it's a bit it's noisy, so you can get it. Okay, well, thank you very much, Inathalia Kwansai, bringing to us the latest of a demonstration by uh, aggrieved customers of men's gold. And we do know that uh, they're protesting or picketing because they feel that the authorities that needed to do the regulation of uh, men's gold and his activities needed to do something about retrieving their monies for them or their investments. Uh, but look, we have to take a break. We told you that we'll bring you some insightful conversation on many other related issues as well. Uh, we're taking a break and then we'll be right back.